What's good? It's your boy T-R-E-N-T, and I'm back one more again. This time I'm back with a brand new album reaction. It's a brand new album. It's by a guy I ran into earlier this week. Uh, Anna Lee Chopper, you know what I'm saying? He seemed like a cool dude. Talk to him for a little minute. But um, since he got a new album and I, I react to albums, this is what I do. I'm about to check out uh, Cottonwood 2. And unlike other YouTubers and reactors, I do not skip the song. I do not pause the song. I wait to the end of the song and I give my commentary. So I want y'all to stay to the end of the song so y'all can give y'all commentary to each track. I don't skip the tracks. But anywho, let's check this out. This Cottonwood 2. This is my first time actually um, reacting to one of his albums. So let's see. And we're going to grade each song from 0 to 10. Anything below 5, if y'all think it's trash, that's five and below. If it's mid, average, okay, that's a six. Seven and above is a good song, just depending on how good you think it is. So without further ado, this is Cottonwood 2, NLE Chop. Fucking Penny going on a bunch of making reaction bits. <laughs> I hate you niggas that make reaction bits. <laughs> talking about when i'm listening to the albums when i'm doing the reactions man this is the type of music i'm trying to find bro i'm trying to find that music make me just when you hear that hoe that hoe come on and you like oh that hoe hard that hoe hard then when he talking that shit when a nigga talking that shit all the other shit i was like them other songs was good this song may be good bro this whole when I say, like, my zero out of ten, y'all already know when I'm talking that shit, it's a ten, bro. He was talking that shit. He was walking on that hoe. And then he put Kevin Gates on that shit. Like, 
This one thing I want to say about NLE Chop about the personality side. He remind me of me, but he remind me on some hip hop shit. He remind me what we witnessing with him. He is the new generation. This new generation plies. And what I mean by that, let me tell y'all what I mean by plies. That's no, that's no diss to him or no, that's really a compliment because plies when he came out bro he popped when plies pop first pop all the bitches wanted plies like all the bitches wanted a nigga like a hood ass thug ass talking crazy ass nigga that talked that freaky shit you get what i'm saying like bitch i eat your you know what i'm saying like ain't no shame in a game type of niggas and he also was still a hood nigga. He was still a goon. You know what I'm saying? All the niggas wanted to be like him. Wanted to, you know what I'm saying? So, we haven't seen one of those in a minute. Usually, how music is now, I mean, everybody got like who they like and want to be, but there's no person that, like, future is another. Like, all the niggas... Try to be like Future. All the girls want to fuck with a nigga like Future. You have Drake. But niggas don't want to be like Drake. I wouldn't mind being like Drake. Because I'm a Scorpio. I understand that nigga mentality. I could cake up with a bitch. You know what I'm saying? But anywho. Anyway, Future or Drake, you're going to get Scorpio vibes. I'm a Scorpio. I can give you both. But. The plies narrative I'm trying to say is Plies had the hood music for the niggas. He had the he had that fucking music for the bitches. Everybody liked him. Then he started doing his funny shit. The white people started liking him. He started doing whatever the fuck he want to do. Start wearing suits, um, being funny. Um, nigga just became a character basically. And people fell in love with the character more than they did his music too. So he got he had like all three things going on. And that was the last time we seen somebody that's social. We don't see, you know what I'm saying? Every blue moon you may catch a, a rapper or somebody on live, but they don't be fucking around fucking with the people like y'all think. And a Lee Chopper, he be fucking with the people like he be pulling up on niggas who do um reaction videos and he'll do some reaction videos with them. So that's like some of the realest shit, coolest shit. That's some shit I'd do if I was like popular or some shit. I'll be doing some regular lame shit that niggas consider lame, but it's fun to me. And that's how he moving. And this song is a fucking, man, it's a 10, bro. I'm about to add it on my playlist. I'm about to download. I really want to run it back. That's what I usually do when I give 10s. So like I said, this is going to be a long video. I got to run this whole back. That hoe too hard. That hoe too hard. If y'all don't want to hear it again, Click that next video. If not, I holla. But we rocking out. All the people said it was a 10. Stay with me. Cause I'm a drug addict She 
Hitting on niggas, my head be heavy. Fuck another nigga, bitch, it's heavy. Yeah, she eating dick, Gucci in my ass. Told her to toast my salad. Yeah, badass habit. Fucking on ratchet, space is average ass, ass. Badass habit, feel like an addict. Bro, I'm an addict outside your address. Bad habits do exist, so I'm trying to quit. Got a lot, I wanna fuck every bitch, no, nah, for real Bad habits do exist, so I'm tryna quit, yeah Rich is here, dick, putting my niggas on me Got so jealous, wait till I catch you Wait till I pull up a dick and I bless you Said that nigga be getting upset when you out of compliance We're telling me, yo, I'm about to bad whenever I meet you Come in, yeah, I'm about to bless you I put your legs up in the air behind your head You know I'm special, look in your ass Put your hair, dick in your back I'm about to stretch you, yo, the balls keep up Make that pussy scream, watch your Shitting on niggas, my habit. Fuck another nigga, bitch is a habit. Yeah, she eating dick, Gucci in my ass. Told her to toast my salad. Yeah, badass habit. Fucking on ranches, facts is average. Ass is ass. Badass habit. Feel like an addict. Bro, I'm an addict outside your address. Bad habits do exist, so I'm trying to quit. Yeah. Hey, asking God why I wanna fuck every bitch. No, for real. Bad habits do exist, so I'm trying to quit. Yeah. Hey, Richie, see your dick put. Hey, bro, but the reason I gave this another thing, a reason, another reason I gave it a 10 is because the shit they talking about, bro, like, niggas, them niggas some freaky-ass niggas. I'm a freaky-ass nigga myself. I'm a Scorpio, and, like, I'm trying to get away from these bad habits, like, nigga, like, trying to fuck every bitch and shit. Like, in my head, I be wanting to low-key. Them the bad habits I have. I be wanting to fuck him. Like, he went, I'll go to my counselor. We got to fit. Ah, oh, fuck you, bitch. But I got to get these thoughts off my head. So even when I go out, I don't be hollering at females and none, none of that shit. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm not about to waste y'all time. I'm a gentleman. And if a bitch fuck with me, I'm going to fuck her real good. It's, it's going to be too crazy. I don't want to deal with the problems that come with that shit. So I rather not deal with it at all you dig but um anywho i gave it a 10 this is like the best song i heard on the album so far but we still got some more songs if y'all want me to react to other songs i didn't get to let me know in the comments if y'all stay with me to this long don't forget the leo grade i'm going to the next video y'all meet me there you dig? Ah.